So let's talk about etch primers. So we've talked about epoxies. So much like epoxies, etch primers is another chemistry that has been utilized for years to protect against corrosion. So the ion exchange, uh, exchange occurs and deposits a layer of iron oxide on the surface of the substrate. So this is a passiv passivization uh, step. So the iron oxide layer protects from moisture penetration and promotes adhesion uh, to the substrate. Etch primer activators contain a phosphoric acid to help drive this ion exchange. So primer, uh, etch primers contain the uh, polyvinyl butyrate resin, which helps form a barrier over the new iron oxide layer. Now, all of this action, reaction takes place at the at the substrate layer. So down at, down at the bottom on the top of the substrate. The one thing with the with these products, over applying these products provide more harm than benefit. So applying them correctly is very important. The nice part is that they they don't uh, interfere or don't change any of the texture of your of your next coatings. You know, so it doesn't telegraph through. So. A little bit different than what epoxies do. Uh, the other ones that are out there is these chrome-free etch wipes. So much like the uh, etch primers, there's the ion reaction going, right? The, the, uh, they react with the clean metal surface and generate a metal ion. Uh, these things here uh, create basically a crystallization on your your substrate so it, it'll actually etch into the metal and then create a, a um, crystals up on top that your you get better adhesion because it's in, increasing the surface tension on your your substrate so it's great for putting your primer on top of now if you over apply it wet it up too much the structure actually become can be brittle and you can get poor adhesion because you've over over applied so these things are excellent these etch wipes are excellent for small areas for for breakthroughs for body lines for small stuff this is not intended for something like a like a hood that you've stripped down to bare metal right that that would be something you put epoxy on or you would put a an etch primer on these are for for small spots these these this product here is also not recommended for use with our waterborne sealer so anybody spraying any of the 5650, uh, it is not recommended to use the, the etch wipes with it.